Time now for Don Spotlight. There's different types of running. So like there's therapeutic running and there's running like to run fast. Sometimes like I'll just want to go out and I'll just want to go for a jog by myself. It'll be like my way of thinking things over. Sometimes running for me is just running fast. I'll go on the track and I'll do some 150s or I'll do some 200s and I'll just, I'll just run them quick. I just feel like I'm in charge of my body, like I have complete power. Woo. I'm Hugh Nicholson and I'm a middle distance runner in the track and field program at USF. When I was a kid, I had played soccer and I, and I ran up until when I was about 16. I did it for the fun of it and then when I was 16 I was like, okay, like, I want to have a crack at this now. And I quit soccer and I just started to focus on track. In my first ever nationals on the track, I, got, I won my first race ever and kind of went from there like in terms of serious. This could be something that I could be good at. At home, there's no collegiate system in Australia. I didn't have the training partners, I didn't have the support, I didn't have the, the same facilities that you have here. When you're coming out of being a junior, you either, generally what people do is they either go straight into like, straight into Olympic teams. I don't quite think I'm at the level now where, where I, can, I can make an Olympic team, but I need something to bridge me there and I think the US was a perfect fit for that, that can bridge me into being a senior athlete that I want to be. I was looking for a coach that understood where I was coming from. I was looking for a program where to have all these great guys to train with. I wanted to have someone that not just push me, but also, I guess, keep me in line and keep me focused on my goals. So, and I think basically that's what Helen and Benji offered better than anyone. Q is hands down the most talented athlete that we've brought into our program as a freshman. He has the talent and he has the tools to be a very successful athlete, but he also has the mind and he has the vision. I have a sheet of paper for each year that I'm here and then I have a sheet of paper for after and a sheet of paper for my whole career. Run these times and I've just had, like I've visualised the race and I've known like what I want going into that race. On your mark. You watch him run and you look how good he looks. He has the tools to be a really high level athlete and there's a lot of areas that we can work on to get him to that level. <laughs> 